again, this lighting is very unattractive, but we're going with it. What up, the amazing person currently watching this? It's Basepick, aka M. Um, now this video is going to be very sad, well, sad for me anyway, because um, I read a couple of weeks ago um, that when this tour is over, ACDC will be retiring. Now, it's, it was on Facebook, so I don't know if it's true or not, but I'm praying to the rock gods. It's not true. They cannot be over yet. I'm sorry. I do not care that they're like 60 or 70. They cannot be over yet. I will refuse to believe that. <laughs> um, but it's just really sad for me because I've, granted, I've only loved them for four years and they've been gone since like the 70s or 80s. Um, but, like, I still remember the very first time I heard them. If you refer to my, my music tapes video, I realized I was a fan of all the bands I listen to now from a very young age. I just never knew what the artist was called or what the song was. But I distinctly remember hearing Back in Black and all those amazing songs by them from a young age. And we're talking like five, six, seven, even younger than that. Um, but I distinctly remember the very first time I heard Back in Black, um, well, like the first time I remembered hearing it. It was on to, uh, December 25th, 2012. My dad got Back in Black as a Christmas gift and we were driving to my cousin's house for lunch or something like that um, and he played Back in Black, like the um, he played the album and at first I was like, oh, these guys are alright, they're not the greatest, no offence but then when he played Back in Black I was like oh, what is this? Like it was so good, like I do not know what it was but I just thought these guys were amazing and that's when the obsession kicked in so thank you for that dad no, but I kid you know, he tried to get me into a whole bunch of other bands. It was really only ACDC and the Beatles that stuck. So, thank you to him. Um, but now I'm going to be directing this at the members of ACDC who will probably never watch this video, but if you are, for starters. Oh, you're actually watching this? Just give me a minute. Um, you are absolute rock gods to me. Like, it's, uh, like, let me tell you something. Malcolm Young, who unfortunately has dementia and obviously can't remember anything. He is the reason I want to become a better a better rhythm guitar player. In my opinion, no offense Angus, Malcolm created ACDC. Like without him, I don't think the band would have been as good just because of the thriving rhythm that this band has and it's because of Malcolm. And it, they are just so great and it's so sad that they're over. But you know what? They've been rocking for so long. I'm devastated that they might be over. But you know what? They've been rocking so you know what? I'm gonna salute you. T-shirt quote. Uh, so this is the song I'm currently obsessed with. Please give this video a thumbs up. Comment something positive. Comment something to make me feel better that they'll be over soon. Please. And make sure you hit the subscribe button because I would love if you were part of the musical family at Octopus's Garden. And Octopus's, I need a hug right now because they're coming. Come here. Thank you, I needed that. That was a bit weird. So I don't know if I'll do that again. I probably will, so be warned. I uh, so hope you're having an amazing day, and I'll see you next time. And out, peace, love, rock on, bye. Welcome to Octopus's Garden. I love you, AC Daisy. Don't be over yet. <laughs>